Well, basically, I've been in Delhi for the last 24 years, out of which 14 years I was a freelancer doing shoots and shows and various other things. For the last 11 years, I've been a lot into training and a lot into the business of the salon side of it, which has been quite interesting because from being a total creative person, I'm seeing the business aspect of it now. It's really difficult because I'm more of a creative person, but I do have a lot of people helping me and guiding me, which is, of course, I think very important for ev any organization or any entrepreneur to grow. You need people to guide you and the right kind of people. So I feel I do have the right kind of people guiding me now, as opposed to 10 years ago when I was just lost. I had no idea how to open up a salon or go about um, running a salon. Opening up is the easy part. It's the running of the salon which is really difficult because dealing with staff, dealing with products, dealing with, with expiry dates, dealing with the changing trends, um, you've just got to be on top of it all, which is quite difficult at some times. Um, transforming and introducing new trends every six months definitely at least twice a year we've got to do different things different looks um, different textures different colors of hair nails face so at least twice a year and we've got to keep ourselves updated I do have a team helping me out and informing me I myself I'm interested in the fashion industry so I myself am um, at at um, all the social media sites. I'm also into watching TV on fashion, magazines, so everything. So it's, it's, it's like a whole package. For me as an artist, I like to use all different types of brands, especially the new brands which are coming up in the market, which happens like once every three, four, five months. So I'm not tied down to one specific brand, but I do like to promote certain brands which are professional because professional brands, I believe, are at a lower cost um, range than to generic brands, which you find in malls. So it's better for the professional. And I find professional brands do help us as artists because they're stronger. Um, the colors are a lot more varied. Whereas if you go to a normal makeup shop, it's very limiting. So I, I do support professional brands. There are a couple of brands which I do promote in the studio because they're professional and they're only available with me like Masauda. So that's an Italian brand. So that's available with me. I do promote it. Um, apart from that, I, I use all types of cosmetics. There is um, summer trends makeup which is coming up, which is dewy skin, um, nothing which is too loud, skin has to look a little natural, healthy, glowing skin. Um, it's all about highlighting and shading, strong eyebrows, a little bit of liner. Um, the colors on the lips are going to be ombre, so it's going to be a, a mixture of two colors, uh, and very little color on the cheeks. My makeup brushes, I feel my USP is trying to use one brush in many various ways. So I'm using one brush as a makeup blender, as a contourer, as a blusher. So that's just one brush. So I'm trying to use as least amount of brushes mm -hmm. as possible for various things. So not just one use of a brush for one thing. So basically it's multitasking with my brushes, trying to make the kit as small and compact as possible because no one likes to walk around with a huge kit. It's not possible. I have three salons. Um, one which I've collaborated with Levo. Uh, my main salon being in Lajpat Nagar and also one in CTC Mall. Once again, they had the space and um, I required it for my own needs, so that works perfectly for me. Now for me, collaborating with Levo and Monsoon, they're the only two which I've collaborated with so far, has really worked with me. Um, I think it depends on person to person. For me, I don't really have the time to go around and make more salons and I'm not that way inclined. So for me to collaborate with existing salons and places works fabulously because my strength is teaching. My strength is being creative um, and also guiding a salon as to um, how, how to have a look or how to um, get clients in the makeup industry. So that's, that's my forte and that's what I like to do. 
Well, basically, uh, Vidhitikari, in terms of expanding, I will be expanding with Monsoon. So they're going to go a big way. So there's a lot of exciting work happening in that front. Um, so let's see. I think we are going to go out of Delhi very, very soon.